Hey guys and welcome back. So here is the drag uh, preview and this is how it looks like. So this is a value of 0 0.02, 0 0.05, 0 0.08 and 0 0.15. And as you can see with the higher drag the wave and, and everything is, is really stopping quickly and that affects the scale. It makes it feel uh, at a different scale but also works really well if you have a lot of if you have a choppy or a, a stormy ocean and you have this kind of effect in there it's gonna drag quickly the waves are gonna take over whatever splash you have it doesn't last for maybe one or two second m maybe less um, and so it, it really depends on how much you want the effect to last also with with these type of effects you get uh, what we call the pool effect where basically there is no resistance in the fluid and we don't we do want to have some resistance especially if we want to include a ocean with this and deform it with an ocean surface we have to have and uh, the ocean surface is moving in a different direction we have to have some drag to uh, make it feel end graded and realistic when combining the two effect so maybe a value point of uh, 0. 0 0.02 and we're going to uh, use a different technique later to add specific drags in specific area but the over Oh, uh, the overall drag is going to be uh, uh, of this value you can see here that we're getting a, a nice slowdown but it's not drastic like this one and these two are fine as well it, it depends on how much splash you want if you look at the first frame here this is the highest splash and it, the stronger the value the lower the splash is going to be and that's going to affect as well the the second wave or the second uh, comeback for the for the splash there so it it's really up to you guys on how much uh, drag you want to apply but for our example for the final setting we want to use a value of 0 0.02 and we're going to combine it with other drags as well other localized drag that we can talk about next week Thank you guys for watching and see you in a bit.